What's up, everybody? My name is David Delano, one of the expert handicappers with Winners and Winners.com, along with a writer for Winners and Winners.com with you guys for Monday, September 26, 2022. Make sure you go ahead, like, and subscribe to this channel. That way you're notified anytime myself or one of the other expert handicappers over here drop some content, you will be notified. Also, be sure to follow Winners and Winners and at Get Sports Strong on Twitter. Hope everybody had a good weekend. Uh, we definitely had a good weekend over here. As a, It was a good weekend of baseball, a good weekend of college football, and a good weekend of the NFL. Um, overall, in uh, college football, went 3-1 and one this week on the uh, premium picks. In college football, went 2-1 and one on the college football free picks. Uh, we went 5-1 uh, and one in Major League Baseball on our premium picks. And in the NFL, we went 4-1-1 one, and one on our premium picks, 0-1 oh, on the free picks. And for the third straight week this season, our top three NFL picks cash. As we went 2-0-1 oh, on our top three as we had the Atlanta Falcons money line, had the Detroit Lions covering, and we pushed in the game between the uh, Houston Texans and Chicago Bears. Other two plays I had that weren't on my uh, Top three pack, we did lose the game with the uh, Kansas City Chiefs not covering, but we had the Jacksonville Jaguars. So right now, 14-5-1, all sports run. Um, profitable in the last uh, seven days, profitable yesterday, profitable in the last 30 days, profitable for the season. Every pick's not um, going to be a home run every time. Yeah, there's some bad picks all at some times, but I give out a lot of picks. But at the end of the day, top capper in the NFL, top capper in college football, top capper in Major League Baseball. If you want my top play today, uh, link is in the description. Promo code will save you some money off of that. It's going to be in the game between the Boston Red Sox and the Baltimore Orioles. So if you really want to know what I'm playing, check out that pick. That is my favorite play for today. I'm going to give out a Monday Night Football pick. I don't usually give out disclaimers. I'm going to give out a disclaimer for this one. Okay, I um, handicapped these games. My job is to give you a pick for today. My favorite play is in the game between Boston and Baltimore. Outside of that, at the time of recording, there's a line in the game between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Cincinnati Reds, and there's this Monday night football game between the Giants and the Cowboys. So there's two games out there. Not forced to bet them. Honestly, I don't do this for recreational purposes, believe it or not. Betting Sunday, Monday night games between specifically the Cowboys and Giants long term is not my favorite thing to do. I think there's probably been 30 other games that were probably better in, in football between college and the NFL than this one. But I do have a full write-up on winnersandwinders.com. I'm not going to be long-winded going into this game. Um, there's a lot of thoughts out there. But my pick for this game is going to be the Dallas Cowboys plus one. Ultimately, it really comes down to this uh, Dallas Cowboys defense going up against Daniel Jones and if they're going to be able to make him make mistakes. Uh, Cooper Rush has been in the NFL since 2017. He wasn't bagging groceries. I think that he is going to be stable. The Dallas Cowboys running game is very underrated. I don't think that this is going to be a pretty game. But ultimately, I think that the Dallas Cowboys defense is going to be the difference. And I like the Dallas Cowboys in this game, plus one to cover. Also, interesting stat that I came across. In these Monday night football games, when you have a home favorite who is favored by four and a half points or fewer, they are on a 12-26-1 run against the spread. The, the Giants fall into that category, so that favors the Cowboys. So Dallas Cowboys plus one. This is not the game to bet your... Uh, Mortgage on, although no game is the game to bet your mortgage on. My advice on this Monday Night Football would be if you really like this game tonight and you want to play it, play it. If you want to play it, go ahead and play it. But um, if you don't really feel great about the Monday Night Football game and, you're, and you are you know, you had a bad weekend and you're trying to bail yourself out, remember, next weekend's coming, Thursday's coming, there's baseball, you've got a whole other week coming. Don't bet this if you don't want to, all right? Because personally, I don't plan on betting this one. Now, um, also, though, I do think Saquon Barkley over 23 and a half receiving yards is also a good play for this one. But if you want to know what I am betting, my favorite play is going to be in the game between the Red Sox and Orioles. 
Link is in the description on that. God bless everybody. Thanks so much for spending some time with me. Good luck on whatever you're playing.